What is up guys, Tom here, and today we're checking out Bloodstained Curse of the Moon, the first one. I know, the second one actually comes out today, the literal day this video is going up, but if you guys want to see me do the second one in a similar style, let me know in the comments below. But, Bloodstained's awesome, it's Castlevania 1, 2, and 3 styled, like NES styled, retro action. This game's awesome, and if you guys have not played it, uh, hopefully this video might convince you to. Yeah, so guys, this is Bloodstained 1, and it's basically, in my opinion, one of the best retro styled games I've ever played because it emulates Castlevania perfectly right down to the art style um, but in a lot of ways it's actually better than the games it takes inspiration from because it's not like like there's no bullshit like there's a little bit of bullshit but you just like I actually been wanting to replay this for a long time and um, then they announced the sequel and I was like hell yeah oh I thought I just died and I was like hell yeah but I was like hell yeah um, what better time to play the original than when the announcement of a sequel and I've played this game on this channel before, but my st I, I remember vividly when the game first came out, my stream crapped out. Yeah, Talisman, it's okay. My stream crapped out, like, in the final boss, which is hilarious. And, uh, yeah, that's that's the whole story there, and I'm sticking with it. Ah! Oh, yeah, the hearts actually heal you in this game, not like, on, like, Castlevania. So, huh, I wonder where I have to go. One of my favorite, like, styles of gaming today is, like, the retro... Oh! No! Oh. Is like the retro NES style. Look at this. Look, look at this. How awesome this like bar looks, man. I don't know. It's super nostalgic to me, and I, I'm curious how like. Uh, see, I can't fit in there because I don't have any way of doing that, but other characters can. But guys, let me know what you think of the classic style of games. Like, I'm curious how this retro aesthetic appeals to people besides me who grew up with this stuff. Okay, please, talisman. Hey, talisman. Nice, talisman, baby. Oh, it's so good, man. It's so good. It's, it's basically the holy water in Castlevania. We all know this. But, you know, the Holy Water is like the best, so... Dude, I just love the effect. Like, you see the castle in the distance, the moon... Ah, oh. oh my god, I want more retro-style games, so I'm so happy that they're making a second one, man. Yeah, let me kill this... Let me kill this mofo from up here. See how fucking good I am at video games and strategy? He can't do shit. It's boss time? Yeah, it is. It's the big... Uh, digger fist, man. So, kind of interesting thing. A lot of the bosses in this game were actually also in... Uh, Ritual of the Night. But, like, both games can coexist and have a lot of the same ideas, just done in, like, completely different ways. Oh, I forget. I completely forget what this guy's... Yeah, 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 And then, I mean, not just... Okay. Okay, I got it. I got the strat. I got the strat, boys. You ready? You ready for this? Oh! Hey! He's gonna do a desperation attack, boys. Run! I think I gotta, like... Yeah, we gotta, like, hide behind it. How sick is that, man? Like, I love the, like, cool desperation attacks that they do when they're about to die. Like, one last ditch. Take, like, if I'm going down, you're taking you with me. If I go down, I'm taking you with me! We got our first new character. Which, you know what? Betrayal. Betray. I've never done this before. I've never done this before. So if you, ki instead of recruiting the character, if you kill the characters, you get, you get, like, their abilities. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so now I can do this. See a new aerial attack with a crazy hit angle? I've never done this before, so this is actually very exciting. I never killed the characters. We're getting crazy, boys. And that's just one of the options. If you just recruit the characters as normal, you get multiple characters, which in my opinion is probably the, the way... The, it's just the way that you should play the game the first time. Like, people won't even know you can kill the, uh, the party until after the fact. He's just talking about how much he wishes he had friends. <laughs> oh, man. What the hell is that? I don't remember that. Thing. This new aerial attack, man? Solid stuff. Look at this, look at this hitbox. I'm unstoppable. This is a buff, right? Yeah, this is a buff. Okay, that's the one I want to, like, hang on to. I'm having fun, man. I'm having a lot of fun playing this again. It's just a spear, man. And, yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, and you pushed me right into the... Ah, I want my buff. I like the demon buff. I think it's the best one. Oh, hello. I don't even remember this stage, honestly. <gasps> no! Ah, that's right. That's still a thing, boys. Okay. Take it nice and slow. No, no, no reason to rush! So yeah, man, that Castlevania knockback is still here, but if you put it on easy, it does remove that, as far as I understand. I would never play on easy, though, because we, we don't roll that way. What is... What are these things? Bats! They're really scary-looking big-ass bats, too. Oh, okay. Dude, I love the world. Like, it just looks so cool. Like, it takes me back, but it's also, like, the gameplay is pretty modern. Like, it doesn't... It feels... He just landed on nothing. Like, it doesn't feel like there's any bullshit, which is the real... The real thing that makes this game, like... Modern. Like, there's nothing that's like... <gasps> I 
had to mention there's no bullshit. I had to mention the lack of bullshit, didn't I? <laughs> oh my god, the shield guy again! We good though, we good, we good. These fucking frogs can't stop me, bro. I'm too good, I'm too good. Huh, doing it as just John Getz is actually pretty difficult. This. Oh my god. Okay, I've got it. I've got the strat. Utilize the buffed uh, air slice. Okay, here's boss. What is it? What are we looking at? Some kind of floating creature. It's a turtle. It's a turtle with a face. I don't remember this guy. It hasn't been that long since I played this. Okay. Now just go in there and fucking whack him with the bow. Okay. <gasps> okay. Whatever. He's not hurting anybody now. He can't hurt me now. Damn it. All right. Not ideal. But we're right back in it. Right back in it. Let's kill this fucking turtle. Let's kill this turtle, boys. Fuck! What's he doing? He's dying, that's what he's doing. He's dead. Okay, what's his final move gonna be like? Oh god, do I wanna know? Oh! Okay, it didn't do that much damage. Who was trapped inside the turtle? Oh, we gotta kill the old man. Betrayal. Double kill. <laughs> Give me that power. Mmm, delicious. Remember guys, we're, we're sacrificing playable characters in exchange for the power of the double jump. What is that? What are these things? They're horrifying. It's been long enough that since I played this game, I don't remember what any of the horrifying creatures look like. Well, I can attack and then double jump again. That's pretty cool. So far, so good. Oh god. They're big ass pigs now. Ew, it's a mimic. Can't escape them. I could just bypass these motherfuckers. Hmm. <gasps> no! Ah! <gasps> God damn it, motherfucking PC dog shit! This double jump is going a long way, my dudes. <gasps> God damn the fucking bat, dude! The fuck? Ah! I think I can actually still get that. That's not good, so. Hmm. Almost. Can I? <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh my goodness. That's fine. Put me back where I need to be. God damn it, dude. This fucking knockback is... It's so old school. Mm. It's like headshot damage. What? Why did I do this? God damn it, dude. I went- I hit him, bro. God fucking kill me now. Oh my god. Oh my god. And we're gonna just jump down into this. Okay, we've made it to the boss. Dude, I've been in this level for way too long. It's so much harder than just Zonk gets because they can't just fly through the hard platforming. Alright. So this is Cashman, which, you know, if it's not obvious how to beat him, uh, can I just, oh, I just barely can't reach him. That sucks. Hey, give me that cash. Give me that cash. Hey. Hey, there's no hitbox on his face. That's pretty nice. I don't remember there being gold, gold boys. That was easy. I don't think he could possibly kill me with his, uh, desperation attack. So we good, boys. He's blinding the screen with with gold. It's so goddamn shiny. Okay, we have to go kill our last party member, boys. Finally through with that place, man. That place was rough as just on gets you, man. I'm telling you. Who's even left? Oh, Jeebel, that's right. That's right. The Alucard uh, type. Go rip the trail. Triple kill. Yeah, we can run now. We can run. Gives us a longer jump, too. Oh, yeah. That's good shit. That's the good shit, my boys. I really don't remember these levels. I remember the song, though, which is crazy. Like, I remember the soundtrack. The soundtrack's so good in this game. They're like, oh, you are you kill, you did the kill everyone route. You did the genocide route. Oh, well, that makes it easier. And who said stealing the powers of your friends wasn't worth it? It's like a forsaken castle of sorts. Damn, he's dropping off these frogs fast. There we go. Dropping them off real fast. I don't even know what... Oh, I just realized how low my health is. Uh, shit. Can I, 
can I make that? Nope. It's like it's intentionally just out of my reach. Ah! I think I am ready for this boss, whoever it is. Oh, is it the dragon? I think it's the dragon. It is the dragon. This boss is cool. Whipped my ass a few times last time I played. So let's see how Solo Zangetsu can do with the buff. Oh, I'm still touching him. One dragon face down. Uh oh. Boom, boom, boom. No way that's it. No way it's that easy. Not a chance. Let's go. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, you little bitch! I forgot his little fucking dragon body teeth came at me. Oh my goodness. I was doing so good too. Fuck! I had an itch. I had an itch on my face and it got me killed permanently. Okay, we've done it. He's not even hard, dude. I had a poorly timed itch last time, which killed me. But we got him. Does he... What's... He has no uh, final attack, huh? I guess the he has two phases makes up for the final attack not existing. I guess that makes sense. Okay, we're on a pirate ship now. This is actually where the... This is actually where Ritual of the Night starts. Can we talk about how horrifying these things are, by the way? Like the smiles, like the faces? Good God. Nope! I would love very much for some kind of- Oh! He is really scary looking. Let's go, let's go. Avoid the really scary fucking- Fucker! I swear- God damn! Just go, just go, just go, go! I'm about to die or something real fierce, boys. Something real fierce. Oh, I remember now, the painting. Yeah, yeah, the scary ass paintings. Thank you. Bye bye painting. And I got a life somewhere. Uh, not gonna complain. We we take those. Okay. Please healing. I didn't know I can even go up there. Hey. You sneaky. I was baited. Oh, new piece of dog shit. We're not going that way. <sighs> right, let's go, Sparky ass. Cool effect, very cool effect. All right, so let's see. Is there is there an effect on me right now? Yes, there is. Oh. Oh my no! Get fucked, asshole! Oh, what a pain in the ass this guy is. Alright, I don't remember. He does, like, this crazy thing. And, like... Yeah, he's doing this, like, whole... Mess of shit. Oh my god! I was right fucking there! I was really, really close to death! Holy crap, was I close! Ooh, okay, on to the next stage. After that, uh, horrifying experience with, uh, with the... <laughs> all these fucking things. Okay, hold on, we gotta, like... Recalibrate after that <laughs> That area was not great. It wasn't bad But um, being just Zangetsu makes this way harder because it basically anytime you're about to die you can Just switch your character and just essentially just get more and just get more health What oh God, oh my god Fuck scissor man I remember Scissor Man. He's the scariest thing I've ever seen. Good God, man. If there's one thing I remember about this game, I remember Scissor Man. And I do believe Scissor Man is in uh, Ritual of the Night as well. But, uh, God damn, Scissor Man. Alright, here's how we're gonna handle Scissor Man going forward. We're gonna avoid him, we're gonna dodge him and run. Because I ain't messing with no Scissor Man. This ain't, this ain't no clock tower. I mean, thankfully that one appeared behind me, so. Bunch of creepy Iron Maidens. 
all of them are gonna do something horrifying to me. So we just God damn it! There we go. Okay. Flawless execution, boys. For some reason I remember this area and that scares me. Something's gonna happen. There's, there's a reason I remember this part. Okay, hi scissor man. Hello, other scissor man, the friend of scissor man. Knew there was something back here. I don't know why I remember this part, but it's freaking me out that I remember. <laughs> Actually, I remember now. It's the Castlevania hallway. We all remember the hallway. Right before you fight death in Castlevania 1. And if you don't, it looks just like this. Double jump kind of makes it a little bit easier, not gonna lie. And boss room? I remember now. Yes, the lady in the bath. She's just hanging out in the bath, you know, just, just chilling. She's not trying to kill nobody. I don't remember this boss very well, though. I remember what she looks like, also. I don't remember her very well. Thank you, God. Oh, my God. She was a pain in the fucking ass. Oh, no. I just have to hide in a corner and be good. Ah! I mean, I, I don't know if there's any way to even avoid that, to be completely honest with you, but it's okay. We made it through it. We made it through another one. God damn, dude. This game is way harder than I remembered, and just because I'm doing the solo Zangetsu stuff. Love this music, man. It's so good. <gasps> you little fucker! Don't know how the hell I avoided that. What is that? It's like fucking Griffin? Great, we got griffins now. <gasps> fucking stupid fucking bottomless fucking pits, bro. Gotcha, bitch! Oh no! Oh, I couldn't just hide in the corner for this one. And the painting celebrates. Do not get snatched by the painting, please. <laughs> okay, good, good. Took a hit though, which I still don't prove of, but that's what it is. Should have a new checkpoint now at least. Oh my god, I am so good at platforming. Boss room, please. Please give me the boss room. A full heal? A full heal has gotta be the boss. It's gotta be. I have no clue what the boss of this area is. I do not remember at all. What is it? It's not the boss. That's that's fine. Whatever. Okay, this has got to be it. That's a Mega Man-esque boss door if I've ever seen one. <laughs> or some other painting. Oh, I remember this guy. I remember this guy from Ritual tonight, actually. Oh, okay. I feel like I've almost got him. I'm sure my dude's just been letting me hit him this whole time. Okay, I don't remember what the safe spot is here, so, uh... Right here. Let's go. We won, boys. First try. Oh, and we dodged the fatal blow. And he, like, crashed into himself and blew himself up. Alright, that was the only boss I beat on the first try. I feel like that's worthy of praise. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Cleave the moon. Okay. Whoa! Oh, that's right. I, re I recall now. I remember everything about the stage immediately. Just, just go. Just go. This is the stage we're being chased by crap. This is the stage we're being chased by crap, my dudes. Oof. Getting chased by some Lynels over here, dudes. They're basically just the same as the, the assholes. <laughs> That's what they're called, the assholes. Oh, there goes the buff. Fuck. Damn. Yeah, this stage is horrifying. No! Oh, come on. Oh, come on! Are you kidding me? I remember this part. I remember this part very much. 
No, my god! Okay, we good, we good. We good. We good, it's not even anywhere near me. We're that good, we're that pro, boys. Got our demon buff back. We are ready for... Oh, god! What is this creature? I don't want to know, we're gonna avoid him. We're gonna go up here. Hmm, it's actually much easier as Zangetsu solo. Because, you know, you can just jump that shit. Like the shot of the moon back there. Such ambiance. Oh my god. No, no more of the fucking frogs. I lost my buff for you, frog. <gasps> god damn, the fucking stupid frogs, dude. Perfect. Perfect run through. Alright, now, if I remember this part right. Yeah. Let's do it, boys. That's right. That's right. That's right. I remember the secret. Just like Castlevania 1. There we go. That they we know. And we get a free one up out of it. Getting all the hookups possible to prep for this boss fight. Because that's right. It's time. Now this boss, I had to cheese this boss, dude. Grand Marie was a huge bitch to me. Oh, oh, come on, that's dirty. Okay, phase one down easily, actually, which I'm shocked by. Double jump goes a long way, I suppose. Now for phase two. Can we beat phase two first try? This is where, this is where my original stream, when the game first came out, crashed. I like this build-up, too. Very old school, but badass. It's cool build up. Looking at the moon. That's the shot, man. That's the that's the thumbnail shot. <laughs> okay, so I remember rarely getting a good chance to hit her. Cool design. I was trying to see if I remember this as well as I thought I did, and I think I do. Yeah, yeah, be, this is actually gonna be easier like like this, I think. Oh, I took the hit though. That sucks. We're doing okay. I don't know if we're going to beat it this first try. That'd be sick if we did, though. It'd be really cool if we could beat it first try. Come on. Now it's like we're on this side this time. I remember the pattern, which is actually kind of shocking, to be completely honest. Oh, did we get it? No way. Okay, nah. Now she's gonna chuck the fucking moon at me. What's happening? Oh, we sliced her in half! Holy shit! I don't remember ever having to do that before. I got a trophy for it, so it's clearly the first time I did that. That must be the Zangetsu exclusive ending? And now we've got the power of Gremory and... What? Did we just turn into something crazy? Okay! Not only did we beat the final boss first try... We beat the final boss first try. I don't know, I'm shocked. So the man who wished for nothing... Oh, I thought, there was, I thought it was going to scroll across the whole screen. I... Well, I missed the story. But Zangetsu is now the new Dark Emperor. A long and horrible night descended upon the land. Bad end. <laughs> So guys, the reason I did this is because I've never actually done this ending before, and I thought it was going to be fun, and it was actually a lot of fun, like, uh, to do the Zangetsu kills everybody ending. Maybe not the best way to showcase the game, but I don't care, man. You're seeing the other characters now in the credits. So guys, this video, I'm going to edit it in a very interesting way, so I hope you guys are looking forward to other videos like this. I hope this turned out well. If you enjoyed it, please, I would appreciate a thumbs up. I would love a subscribe, because I'm trying to do a video like this once per week, if I can. But yeah, guys, this was fun to revisit. The Zangetsu run was way harder than any original run of this game I've ever played. Like, way harder. I got my ass kicked in this game, man. That said, it was still an absolute blast. And look forward to next week when we're going to be checking out uh, Curse of the Moon 2. Which I am really, really excited about. Because this game is one of my favorite, like, old school retro style games. And Curse of the Moon 2 is looking to be... Just as good, if not even better. So guys, if you enjoyed this, let me know in the comments below. I greatly appreciate you watching. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.